I've got this quote that I use uh, for my show, and that'll kind of lead into my next question. It's, if your actions inspire others to dream more, learn more, do more, and become more, you are a leader. That's John Quincy Adams, one of our first presidents of the United States. And that's the kind of leader I think you are. You're not a leader in the traditional sense. And I talked earlier about how you moved me uh, when we were out that evening with my family, uh, with my friends. So that leads into the next question. If someone asked you, what does Samuel Tyrone Cotton stand for? What would you tell them? Not what they think about you, which I always say may not be suitable yeah. uh, for TV, but what would you tell them about yourself? I'd say I have a sense of adventure. Okay. Um, I could think so. Uh, I don't know, respectful of others, uh, passionate. About, well, you know, mm -hmm. I think I'm passionate about the music. And I got you, passionate, okay. Do you think there's a difference in today's musicians than in past generations in terms of career challenges, in terms of creativity, which is obviously a subjective thing? I think, uh, I think the business has just changed a lot, you okay. know, especially with technology. Um, um, I think the, you know, a lot of the major labels have had their problems, and I, sure. think there, I think there's been like the rise of management groups and... Mm -hmm. So I, I think the fallout's not clear yet. I think it's still working itself it's an, out. It's, yeah, it's, and, it's a transformative yeah. process. Yeah. But um, I still think the old, some things still apply yesterday or today, and it's, you know, vision and, you know, ex mm -hmm. execution and results. Mm -hmm.